One of my top 5 weirdest Magic cards of all time. Magic the Gathering has been around for 30 years, and in that time we've had lots of rule changes and weird card designs. Here are my top 5 weirdest Magic cards, and if you think I'm wrong, get in the comments and tell me your favourite. At number 5 it's Spellweaver Volute. Spellweaver Volute is delightfully weird, an enchantment that enchants a card in a different zone. Possibly a callback to Spellweaver Helix from Mirrodin, Spellweaver Volute instead comes from Future Sight as a future shifted card, something that may or may not be printed in a future set of magic. Animate Dead does a similar thing temporarily, but Spellweaver Volute is the first aura that enchants something that is neither a permanent nor a player. At number 4 it's Salvala Explorer Returned, a relatively modern entry to my top 5 from Conspiracy. Salvala is weird because her ability is both a mana ability that draws a card, and a mana ability that produces an indeterminate amount of mana. Mana abilities that draw cards have historically fed into some of the weirdest situations in Magic due to replacement effects. For example, with Words of Wilding, instead of drawing a card, your mana ability is actually creating a 2-2 bear. But the weirdest part is the non-determinate amount of mana. Because it's a mana ability, you can have a spell on the stack, try to pay for it, and find that you don't have enough mana to pay for it. Because of this, the spell gets reversed and returned to whatever zone it was in, but you can't reverse Selvala's mana ability because it draws a card. At number 3 it's Word of Command. With its iconic art present from the first printing in Alpha, Word of Command is the only card that controls a player while the spell is resolving and still on the stack. Similar modern effects like Mindslaver and Emrakul control a player for an entire turn, which makes far more sense. Word of Command is cheaper at Black Black, but more limited in that your opponents can respond by casting other spells. However, not only do you get to control your opponent during resolution of Word of Command, you also get to control them while the chosen card is resolving if it's a spell, so you can make choices on resolution. At number 2, the Judge's Nightmare itself, Panglacial Worm. Printed in the otherwise fairly normal Cold Snap set, Panglacial Worm simply allows you to cast it while you're searching your library. This causes problems, because it allows you to activate mana abilities while you're already searching your library, and from Selvala we know that mana abilities can also draw you cards at the same time. Panglacial Worm is the sole reason why you have to keep your library in the same order while you're searching, precisely for its interaction with mana card draw effects. You also start getting into murky ground with Selvala specifically. You get to look at the top card of your library while searching, which is the card you would draw with Selvala. You can in theory then try to cast the worm, fail, and then reverse everything except for Selvala's card draw and mana generation, but at a competitive rel you will get disqualified if you had no chance of casting the worm, and this is why judges hate the worm. And at number 1 it is Urtai's Meddling. From Tempest in 1997, Urtai's Meddling allows you to exile a spell with delay counters on it, and then when the delay counters are depleted, put the spell on the stack as a copy of the original spell. This is weird because A it doesn't trigger on cast abilities, it's not being cast. If the target has phased out and phased back in again since the spell was cast, the delayed spell can still target the original target. And if you meddle a morph, instead of the original spell, you get a 2-2 colourless nameless creature with no text on resolution. Very few abilities bypass casting to put things directly onto the stack. Epic abilities are the only other one I can think of. So that's my top 5 picks, but what did I overlook? What is your favourite weird magic card? Let me know in the comments, and if you like this video don't forget to like and subscribe.